Hi friends, this video is about how to determine the rigidity modulus of material of wire using torsional pendulum with masses. By using this formula, we can find out the rigidity modulus of the material of the wire. To find rigidity modulus of wire, following apparatus are required. We start with suspending the wire through chuck in the stand and fixing a disc with chuck at another end of the wire. Adjust the length of suspended wire by marking the required length from the disc chuck to the upper chuck. Then the remaining wire is pulled out through upper one. Then the suspended disc is slightly twisted that results torsional oscillations. Each oscillation of this case about half circle is enough without wobble. So omit some initial oscillations and note the time taken for 20 oscillations by considering a marked point on the disc. Similarly, note the time taken for 20 oscillations while placing two identical masses closer to the disc chuck and also note the time taken for 20 oscillations while placing two identical masses far from the disc chuck. Repeat this step 2 for various length of suspended wire and tabulate the noted readings. Closest distance between the suspension of wire and the center of symmetrical mass is measured when the identical masses are placed closer to the disc chuck. Maximum distance between the suspension of wire and the center of symmetrical mass is measured when the identical masses are placed far from the disc chuck. Radius of wires are measured using screw gauge. Measure the mass of the identical mass using a balancing weight scale and note it. List out the observed readings. Moment of inertia of the disk is calculated by substituting the observed values in the formula. Rigidity modulus of the material of wire is calculated by substituting the observed values in the formula. These are the results of the experiment.